for the last time. I don't need to write it down. I've got it all up here. See salmon, blueberries, eggs, barley, water, vitamin B12, you see? I won't end up like them. I remember trips to South Carolina. I remember Lenny Williams' Cause I Love You. I remember trees become so clumsy in the fall. I remember getting the news. I remember holding my mother upright. I remember knees succumbing to sentences. I remember unsettling cackles. I remember never wearing that suit again. I remember him being so stoic, statuesque. He has his mother's quiet. You can see it in his beard, in the way he tries to shush the gray. My dad, holding on to synapses for dear life, pleading to still have the option of being ashamed of his sins one day. See, Nana, Nana don't talk no more. Used to have Holden Caulfield in her speech. Now she sounds like missed phone calls. It's all leaving her. Every decision, every regret, a burning cradle as she dives into oblivion. Head first. This disease thinks so highly of itself. It sits in interrogation and says, I ain't snitching on nobody. And grandpa, he's got it too. I never correct him when he gets my name wrong. At least I remind him of someone, right? It's good practice. He went blind a few years before his diagnosis. Smart. That's how I do it. Don't have to confuse the world in here. With the world out there, everything stays exactly like I remember. I've been running from this so long. My soul needs a second wind, these incessant genes with a God complex, giving and taking. And she takes pride in her hips, but there's some things she wish she hadn't gotten from her mama. Dad wishes it hadn't gotten to his mama. The woman that made him man, disappearing without a wooden box, ain't that brandish? The gall of these professional thieves to break into your home while the sun is up. I mean, the idea is just ridiculous. Dying from a life you can't recall living. Side hugs are bad enough. Side hugs from family members are far worse. I never thought I'd have to say, do you remember me? Grandma, last time I saw you, you were this big. Happy birthday. Is it mine or yours, she says. And we laugh uncomfortably together. She takes her jacket and puts it to her nose as if the clothes she's worn for years all smell like someone else. You know, I'll never forget what she said to me that one night. It was a, she, she said, 